Bihar has been suffering the wrath of Mother Nature and the troubles for those in the state have trebled. While the Chief Minister Jitan Ram Maji has conducted an aerial survey and has promised that he will take all necessary steps to allay the fears that were looming large in the minds of the people in the affected areas, rivers continue to show their ugly side. Here's a special report to gauge where things stand in terms of the flood scenario. In Bihar, nine districts have been hit by floods which have claimed two lives and have affected four lakh in total. Around 38,000 people have been evacuated so far and 75 relief camps have been set up in the affected districts. Darbhanga, Nalanda, West Champaran, Supal, Saharsa, Navara, Sheikhpura, Sita Mahi and Patna district have been affected by the floods. Flood water has entered the Niawan and Belchi blocks in Patna district. It has come from the adjoining Nalanda district where the Panchani and Sakri rivers are in spate resulting in floods. In Darbhanga and West Champaran, floods have occurred due to breaches in the embankments of Kamla Balan and Gandak rivers. The Disaster Management Department has sounded a high alert in 28 flood-prone districts of Bihar. Meanwhile, the water level of Kosi River has risen, impacting villages in between the river and its embankment in Supal and Saharsa districts. Flood waters have spread over 27 blocks covering around 160 panchayats in the nine districts. Chief Minister Jitin Ram Maji, accompanied by Chief Secretary Anjani Kumar Singh and Disaster Management Department Principal Secretary Vyas Ji, have conducted an aerial survey of inundated areas and ordered all-out efforts to provide relief to the people. The DMD is providing food grain and Rs 4,700 to families in whose homes flood water has entered. A total of 487 boats, which include motor boats, government country boats and private boats have been put to use. While Kosi, Bagmati and Adwara group of rivers show an uptrend, the level of other major rivers like Mahananda, Gandak and Kamla Balan is showing downward trend. The Kosi, Gandak, Kamla Balan and Bagmati are in spate following heavy rains in their catchment areas in Nepal. Reports coming in suggest hundreds fled their homes after water entered their villages in Supal, Saharsa, Baghar, Gopal Ganj, Madhubani, Sita Mari, Khagaria, Darbhanga and Madhepura. The state government has asked engineers and district officials to keep a 24-hour vigil. Powered by NNIS.